Number three, this graph is showing a proportional relationship, an approximate one, between uh, time passed and gallons that are filling up a pool of water. And uh, about how much water is in the pool after 25 minutes. Here's 25. Now, if this is approximately proportional, that means that it's probably going to follow a straight line through the origin. And I can see that at 25 minutes, I go straight up, I stop when it crosses, and then I go straight over, and it looks about a little under 400, probably about 375-ish, I don't know, somewhere around there. I'm going to say about 300 and 60 anywhere between there and 380 I think you would be okay gallons of water after 25 minutes now for 500 we're gonna do something similar 500 gallons of water in the pool we're gonna look at the 500 there's already kind of a line there for that and then where it hits the red we're gonna drop straight down and this one looks right about halfway between the 30 and 40 so I'm gonna guess about 35 minutes have passed when there's 500 gallons into the pool. And then finally, the last one, we have to find a constant estimation. And anytime I do a constant estimation, I usually just kind of make a little table to get my quantity straight. And I look for an ordered pair that's on an intersection. And I found one right here that's pretty close. In 40 minutes, it can put out about 600 gallons. So I take that relationship and I take my calculator and I divide the two numbers and it will tell me the number that gets me back and forth. So 15, I can do one minute of pouring and get 15 gallons out of that, out of that hose into the pool. So answer is 15.